Good evening, I'm Alex Dierkman. Purdue University President Mitch Daniels announced 10 initiatives today aimed at improving education and research in the so-called STEM fields, science, technology, engineering, and math. One of the bullet points includes focusing more on online education. Daniel says he would like to see fewer traditional lectures and instead incorporate more online components. He also recommended developing a year-round academic schedule that he says would help students finish degrees faster and improve graduation rates. Daniel says the changes can steer more funding towards key academic areas while sticking to a pledge to hold down tuition. Owen County officials are working to put a price tag on the circuit court expansion the legislator approved earlier this year. At budget hearings last week, the, circuit count, the, county, the county council declined to appropriate any money for the project as part of the overall 2014 plan. The council plans to hold a special session in October once the committee has completed its cost evaluations. At that meeting, the council could set aside money to get the court up and running as early as November. The state legislator created the second court earlier this year. Owen County Circuit Court Judge Lori Quillen says her extensive caseload is something that should have been addressed years ago, but she's grateful to finally receive help from the state. Two neighborhood playgrounds in Bloomington will be closed in mid-September to paint equipment and conduct routine maintenance. Here are the two playgrounds, Crestmont Park and Winslow Woods Park. Alternate parks will be available during maintenance. Visit indianapublicmedia.org for the closing dates and alternate parks. And here's a look at the weather. Tonight will be mostly clear, 70 degrees as the low. Tomorrow will be 91 degrees as the high and 70 degrees as the low and mostly sunny. And here's a look at the five-day forecast. Wednesday, a 30% chance of thunderstorms. Thursday, a 40% chance with 88 degrees as the high. Friday will be mostly clear with 72 degrees as the high. For WTIU News, I'm Alex Dierkman.